Well, on EA Sports, and we are at Highmark Stadium in upstate New York. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one between the Green Bay Packers and the Buffalo Bills. And we are underway in Buffalo. Amari Rogers to return it from his end zone. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Cost him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. Rogers going to come out throwing. Oh, he's going to take a shot right away. He's got a man complete. And he's going to be taken down at about the 33. Even later into his career now, there aren't too many guys that can launch it downfield with accuracy better than Aaron Rodgers. And that's how you start a drive, because you know they have this play in their back pocket, waiting for the right time to unleash it. And boy, did they pick the right opportunity, unleashed it big time, and that was also a big time throw. And here's Jones again on second down. And this won't be enough to pick up the first. A gain of two, third and one. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. Rodgers to throw on third and one. Able to find Lazard. And he is going to have a Packers first down as they're able to convert on third and short yardage with a gain of four. Now a first down carry by Jones. And just a couple yards there down to the 17. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Now it's Rodgers. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. Nice job there, forcing that incompletion. This is going to be a fun battle throughout this game. Watching him try to take away that area of the field. Here comes the seventh play in this opening drive. They've moved it well, but here's third down. To throw, it's Rodgers. And that will be caught, but out of the end zone, says the field judge. It's ruled incomplete. So now on fourth down, Rodgers will give way to Mason Crosby for the field goal try. The kick by Crosby is good, and the Packers are off to a 3-0 lead. Well, given where they started that opening drive, CD, I think to get three out of it, probably a pretty good start that they'll take. I think you're exactly right about that because they just shook off the effects of the kickoff in field position and took the ball and moved it downfield. Didn't pay off with a touchdown, but that drive, that was really nice for them, and they did come away with three points. Allen and the Bills now with a first and 10 at their own 26. Throwing to start the drive. Allen. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. They certainly did a nice job improvising there, extending the play, hoping someone would come open downfield, but they never did. Once again, they'll come up on the 26-yard line, second and 10. Here's a pass swung out left to his running back. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Allen now on first down. Isaiah McKenzie hauling it in. And he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. So into Packer territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 32-yard line. Meanwhile, Allen's throw will be caught by McKenzie. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. Not sure what happened out there, but it looked like the timing was a little off on that throw. Well, you know I'm a defender, so what am I going to say? Great defense. And darn right, they did something to disrupt that timing. 
Now a second down throw for the end zone, but it's incomplete. It's been a good opening drive offensively thus far, but you know they don't want to waste it and settle for a field goal attempt after that incompletion. So this is a big play coming up here on third down. Throwing is Allen on third. Being chased out left. Oh, he's got a man wide open, complete. Touchdown, Bills. Gabriel Davis, an 18-yard touchdown grab. And the Bills have answered that early field goal to take a first quarter lead. Now on this play, he just made a great round. The quarterback had to deliver it, sure, but a great route run there. And Brandon, this is what the best receivers do. They work on their route running. Because it's one thing to have athletic ability, but to really get open, you have to set up defensive backs with different routes and be precise in your cuts. After the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. On the return from his end zone, Rodgers. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Costs him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And last time able to get three. It's not what they wanted. They wanted six, but they got at least something. They mustered something out of the drive. They'll take it. Just I, I like the way you, you've described it. Not ideal, but they'll take it. Anything to put some points on the board. But this time on offense, they don't even want to see the field goal kicker try it on the field. <laughs> they want that ball in the end zone. They'll be going for six. Call it a gain of a yard, and it'll be second down. Rodgers with a give. It's Aaron Jones looking for a cutback lane, but nothing there as he's met at the line of scrimmage. Now Rodgers on the bootleg. Got a man. It's Tunyon. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. After one, 7 3 the score. On EA Sports. So now then, the big play has him all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. And inside give to Jones. And he gets forward up the middle, but only for a couple. It'll be second down. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Working from the gun, Rodgers. And he's got his man. Touchdown, Green Bay. It's Alan Lazard. A great effort there. 27 yards. And the Packers have regained the lead. Extra point up and good by Crosby. And the lead is now 10 to 7. Now after the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. McKenzie now from his end zone. And he returns this to the 22. Bills come to the line to start their next drive. A long drive last time out for this offense, Charles. If you remember, they started basically in the shadows of their own end zone. March looking for Diggs, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Eric Stokes. And into the end zone. It's a pick six and a Packer touchdown. Extra point try now for Crosby. It's good to make it 17-7. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. McKenzie now from his end zone. Now a hit and a loose football. And the Packers pick it up. And his guys will take over at the 30-yard line. So problems compounding themselves here on the return. They just give up the touchdown, and now they lose the football. Yeah, partner, things are starting to unravel a little bit for them right in front of our eyes. They're going to be looking for some answers and quickly. And the last run got three. Now here's second and seven. Now Rodgers. This one swung out here to Jones. And he'll go out of bounds in the red zone just inside the 20. 
A gain of 10 as they look to add on to this 10-point lead. So from the 17 now, here's a first and 10. From the shot, and hit behind the line. He lost the football. It's loose. Now this is picked up by the Bills. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. And a little careless there, Charles, on that carry. And it's not just having two hands on the ball. It's tucking it away. It's using your body to keep people shielded off. It's so many different things into taking care of it and having ball security. In that case, and the defense has it covered. It's intercepted. Adrian Amos with a pick. 